Hey everyone, it's Becky. Um, I just have a project to share with you guys. Um, I've altered another mouse trap. Um, so I did, I used the romance novel and I did these um, actually a year ago. Um, I think at this time last year I made some mouse traps or altered some mouse traps with the romance novel paper and they turned out super cute. So I used the romance novel again. Um, so pretty much what I did is just this is just the regular, you know, size mouse trap, and um, I gessoed it, and then I also gessoed, so you can kind of see um, the metal parts. Um, you know, just I just left this part on, but I did put a little bit of gesso over it, um, just to kind of get it to go with the mouse trap because they are like a gold color. So um, I just cut out. I used, I believe. This is from, this front paper is just, you know, one of the, like, note cards you can cut out. And this is from the A4 paper pad. And then this is from the 6x6. And then I went over the edges. I distressed them and used vintage photo. And then I used some um, white chalk ink um, just to kind of tone it down just a little bit. Because um, I wanted it to be kind of more shabby chic than vintage. So... Um, I didn't want, you know, it to make it look too vintage. So, I did go over the edges a little bit with it, um, over the gesso. If you can see that. And then what I did, um, after that, I put the note cards on. I put these in. Let me just show you guys really quick. Hopefully, I don't snap my fingers here. Let's show you the underneath paper. So it's just one of those note cards I cut out. And then um, I did the same, you know, distressed it and all that. It's just one piece. I just cut out the little slots for, you know, where the metal pieces are. And then I put this um, really dainty lace, and that's from Craft Supplies 1, around the edge. And then I put this little tag, um, I think tab <laughs> and um, I just glued it to the edge you know I just cut it out ink the edge and then glued it on and then I pop dotted this one little thing that says 10 things I will never forget I pop dotted that up just to kind of give it some dimension and then I punched a little or you know pierced a little hole in there and then hung some chain and then I used some of the or I made some of these um, little charms out of you know beads from my stash and then this little bell thing I got from Butterbee Scraps, I think, as a like a little free gift. And then I hung a key from Craft Supplies One from a jump ring and the chain. And then I just hung it from you know the little metal piece off the mouse trap. And then I cut these out to go at the top. And this is just a little note card. And then um, I did make this for a friend, so. This is just going to sit up there if she wants to write something on it. And then if she wants to put pictures in it, um, just some forgettable, she can glue it to the picture or just stick it in there. Um, I did have it, you know, I just had this sitting in there like that. And then I had just this kind of, you know, twined in there like that. So, you know, whatever she wants to do with it. And then um, I... On my very first ones I altered, I put some feathers, and it was really cute, so I put some more feathers on, um, and I think these are just out of, like, a big bag of them I got at Joann's, and then I put some of these pearl sprays from Craft Supplies 1, and these are the ones that come, you know, looped already, and then they've got little pearl stems sticking up. There's three of them. I don't know what happened with the third one. There it is, <laughs> right there. And then this is a keyhole resin piece from Melissa's Francis and then these two flowers are from Craft Supplies 1 these are like the one and a half inch black flowers and then these are some new ones that she's got and they they're like daisies and they've got like a bark kind of looking center really cute and then these ones I got from Gisela's shop lavish laces these four right here and I just stuck those in there and then this is a pink one, a half inch one from Craft Supplies 1. And then um, I, down here, 
Um, this is a recollections flower and I just took like the little stem out of the middle and put a half back pearl in. And then I just hung some, you know, took some wire. You can kind of see it, maybe. Um, I took some wire, wrapped it around some lace, and then, you know, did like you would um, for a charm. You know, wrapped it around, made a loop. And so I just have some various laces from my stash. This is from Lavish Laces, um, as well as these two right here. And then this is some like that eyelash trim and I just stuck it in there so I've got some white and black and some cream and then I made another charm to go in the middle down the middle of this if you guys can see that and then the bottom I just have a like one of those maple leaves from craft supplies one hanging from it and then this lace is from um, craft supplies one is the same one that's around the edge and then this lace is from my stash I've had for ever <laughs> for a million years and I think that's pretty much it I just you know stuck it stuck them all together try to make them you know fluffy and shabby so that's my mouse trap and I hope the person that's gonna get it likes it and um let me know what you guys think um and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.